NASA astronauts stuck at the International Space Station still don't know when they'll return to Earth. NASA says it'll be another week or so until they decide how and when to bring them back home. The duo has been up there since June, but leaks on their Boeing spacecraft turned their eight day mission into a much longer stay. Fox's Rebecca Castor has more. Three, two, one, ignition and liftoff of Starliner and Atlas V. When NASA astronauts Butch Wilmore and Sonny Williams launched to space on Boeing Starliner in June, no one expected they'd still be there two months later. They were supposed to stay about a week to test Boeing's new spacecraft, which NASA hopes will provide a second option for shuttling astronauts to the space station. This mission is a test flight, and as Butch and Sonny expressed, ahead of their launch, they knew this mission might not be perfect. Before it blasted off, Starliner sprang a helium leak. Boeing and NASA assessed it and moved forward with the launch. Then more leaks erupted on its way to the space station. Now NASA must decide if it brings the astronauts home on Starliner or if they join the next SpaceX crew mission, which would keep Williams and Wilmore on the ISS until February. We are humans and this is hard on crew members and their families and we take that into account. but. Again, as professional astronauts, they're prepared for this and they're doing great. Our technical experts are all busy um, diving uh, deeply into all the data that's been generated over the past few weeks, planning for our return options and, uh, and preparing for uh, some decision points that are ahead. It will be at least another week before NASA makes a decision, but the agency says if there is an emergency at the International Space Station, which has never happened, the astronauts can leave immediately on Starliner. In Washington, Rebecca Castor, Fox News.